okay? Now, the Quebec Bridge was a riveted steel structured bridge in 1970, 1907. Incorrect a bridge weight capacity by engineers resulted in the bridge collapse, killing 75 Mohawk workers. 33 were natives, 33 were natives, but there were 75 workers, 33 were natives. And that really affected that uh, community way. In 1916, they tried it again. When the central span structure was being raised, it fell again. In the, in the, and it killed 13 workers. 14 was injured. They couldn't figure this out. Francis McMath was a very wealthy person. He took over that area of the Quebec Bridge and began taking on that job assignment with his engineers. Cornelius Henderson was a part of that, okay? In June 1917, the new suspended bridge got on the way. By August 27, the span was completed. Now on board, Henderson with CPC engineers orientated a now common te technique of bridge construction. By construction, by constructing the center span of on barges, which would be raised into position of both cantilevers on both sides and riveted in, that bridge was able to stand.